On Monday, May 20, 2024, the Office of the Special Prosecutor issued a statement on its investigative reports that it conducted on government payroll in the Northern region. In that report, findings indicate that the, there is a non-existing school in the Kumbungu district and its staff going through validation and taking on end salary. But reacting to the OSP's report and its findings, the Kumbungu District Education Directorate, though declined commenting on camera, disagrees with the report. According to the uh, District Directorate of Education, there is no such school as indicated or captured in the OSP's report. And according to them, the Kumbungu District has 89 kindergarten schools, 89 primary schools, and 33 junior high schools. And all these schools have been operational over the years and are still in operation. Northern Regional Secretary of the Ghana National Association of Teachers, NAT, Cosmos Enukwao, falls disappointed that the OSP failed to engage the stakeholders in the region. So indeed, if these ghost names are existing, then I don't know how we can go about it. And because we were made to know that uh, with this digitalized system we are in, especially with the, the come in of the Ghana card, the Ghana ID card, all these things are going to create, uh, stop those ghost names. But if upon all this and stir, then it means there may be some, somebody somewhere doing something that we may not be aware. He emphasized that none of their members has reportedly complained about frozen salaries. Since I came here, I have not received any report from any school called, as you are mentioning, I don't, I don't even remember the name of the school because I don't have the actual documents on it. So you have not received anything. Uh, the district secretary in charge of that school even came to office today. So after the briefing from the chairman, I also asked him, and he said, in fact, he has not received any information for any teacher complaining that his or her salary has been stopped. He, however, stated that NAT does not condone illegality and will not shield any officer should the investigation turn out to be true. So if we are able to prove beyond all reasonable doubt that people take salary that they don't earn it, then the necessary steps will be taken. Because um, people cannot work and they don't get what they want. But people may not work and they are getting what they, they don't deserve. Well, TV3 will continue to follow this development and will bring you up to speed information subsequently. Christopher Marco, TV3 News, Kumungo.